cooler inland. 64 Okeechobee. Good morning, Belglade. 69 degrees. High pressure in control. One to my right, one to my left. And they're starting to move off to the east. As they shift, our winds change direction. So yesterday and overnight, we had a northeast wind. And it's been pleasant. It kept our dew points down in the 60s and 70s. Now it's out of the east. It's pulling in the moisture right off of the ocean. So we crank up the dew points yet again. Check it out. Here's water vapor. You see the ridge of high pressure and all of that dry air aloft right here on top of us here in South Florida and the Treasure Coast, red and orange. We will tap into a little moisture here and there on to our right and to our left, but again, a lot of us staying dry and you see that form of moisture in clouds. Future track by 9 o'clock this morning, we're calling it partly cloudy for all of us on the Treasure Coast and the Palm Beaches. We've got rain hanging out in the Atlantic, but that's where it will stay. We notice a few specks of green starting to show up in South County. I think that area of high pressure is so strong that a lot of us will be staying dry. Again, the only form of moisture we've got over the next few days few cumulus clouds. Check it out. Rain chances don't arrive until late Sunday into Monday as the remnants of Karen get closer to us here in South Florida. Even then it's going to be slim to none. So your forecast as we wrap it all up here, mostly sunny to partly cloudy today. It's much warmer and a little more humid, all thanks to that east wind at 10 miles per hour. 87 expected for the high. They're still below normal. Some of us will breach above normal today, may push near 90 degrees. It's a little hotter, making it for a decent day to get out on the boat or maybe go to the beach. No hazards in place, finally and winds on the east right off the ocean at 10 knots. Rip currents are moderate, so take it easy if you're going out in the water. Seas one to two feet. Next high tide right around 730 this morning. Here's South Florida certified most accurate forecast. There's that area of high pressure I'm talking about. We see it Friday and Saturday, 87 degrees pushing near normal, but rain chances start to increase again as Karen pushes closer to us the remnants of what's left and really then the rain chances are held down to a minimum about a 20 for 30 percent shot Monday all the way through Thursday and as a result of a rain chance and a little more cloud cover our temperatures go back down into the mid 80s. All right, Brilly, thank you. Now it's time for your first alert traffic update taking a look.